to the Home Buyer's Guide. I'm Suesha Savant. What are the things that you want in your dream home? Good location, great connectivity, top-of-the-line amenities, a strong structure, a place that offers luxury and comfort, breeds happiness and positivity. The list just goes on and on. But very simply, all you're looking for is quality construction, delivery on time with all that was promised, and you want all this at a price that suits your pocket. If you are in the market for all this but are not too sure of how to access the best options, then you have come to the right place. I have all the listings and information you need to make the right choice. In today's show, I have three of the hottest properties from across the country lined up just for you. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started, shall we? Mumbai is called the city of dreams and the one dream that most Mumbaikars have is to buy their own home within the city, only if it was that easy. Not only do you have to have the budget, but also ensure that the developer is reputed and can make your home buying process simpler. This is exactly what I will help you to do today. On the Home Buyer's Guide, the property that I have handpicked for you is of a reputed developer who has come out with many successful projects and townships in the past. take you through the first project that I have handpicked for you, which is the Trees by Goldridge Properties, one of the most popular residential developments in Bikroli. Let's first talk about Bikroli as a location. Bikroli lies somewhat in the center of Mumbai and provides easy access to most nearby cities through the roads that run through it. The Eastern Express Highway connects it to Thane, Dadar, Chambur and Vashi. The recently built Jogeshwari Vikroli Link Road connects it to Bandra, Jogeshwari and other western suburbs. Around 80% of the population residing in Vikroli are families of Godrej employees, hence making it a very close-knit town. Experts believe over the next several years, Vikroli is likely to be the single largest inner city real estate development in Mumbai, offering untapped growth potential both from an end user as well as an investment perspective. Even Knight Frank, the global property consultant, has featured Eastern Mumbai as one of the top 10 locations in India for global real estate investment opportunities. This leafy neighborhood strategically commands Mumbai's physical geographic center. It enjoys the best urban connectivity the city has to offer. Apart from the Eastern Express Highway and the Jogeshwari Vikroli Link Road, Vikroli is also a major station on the Central Railway. Mumbai's newly built metro and the monorail are also close by. Another plus is the Eastern Freeway which is within driving distance. As a result of this, every part of Mumbai is within convenient reach. It takes about 20 minutes to Fort via the Eastern Freeway and just 15 minutes to BKC via the Santa Cruz Link Road. The future high-speed connection between the current airport and the proposed new airport across the creek will further transform the Eastern Belt into the central destination for Mumbai. The Trees development is the first mixed-use node that marks the gateway to Vikroli. The master plan consists of three walkable grounds. The commercial area is spread across 9.4 acres, houses Godrej 1 and a second commercial office building. Godrej 1 will have several Grade A office spaces built in it. Let's now move to the part that you've been waiting to hear about, the residential neighbourhood. It is the most active quarter spread across 9.2 acres, which will comprise of a five-star luxury hotel, cultural buildings and a high street retail park in the vicinity. However, the more private residential area will be built across 6.7 acres and will house a community of residential buildings with private parks and swanky amenities. The public open spaces will house a number of the treasured old buildings adapted for new uses such as cafes, bars and galleries. The plan will also be focused on the space between buildings connecting neighbourhood conveniences, well-appointed amenities, fine dining restaurants, culture spaces and Wi-Fi enabled plazas. The project delivery is expected by December 2019. It's 
time to look at the cost of this project. So how much will you have to shell out for this project? The prevailing rate for this project is at an average of 15,500 rupees per square foot. A 1 BHK begins at Rs 15,700 per square foot, so a 1 BHK here will cost you between 1.64 to 2.15 crore rupees. A 2 BHK apartment here will start from nearly 2.30 crore rupees and will go up to 3.2 crore rupees. A 2.5 BHK will be between 3 to 4 crore rupees and a 3 BHK will cost you anywhere between 3.5 to 4 crore rupees approximately. But if you're looking for more space and want to live right on the top, then you can opt for a penthouse in the trees, which will cost you anywhere between 8 to 9.5 crore rupees. So what kind of amenities can you expect from the trees? Let's take a look. Firstly, the entire township is enclosed within a gated community, which provides a nice, cozy, livable surrounding. The project boasts of a swanky clubhouse, which will sit under lush rain trees. For all the sports enthusiasts, you can choose between a range of sports and relaxation facilities, including the swimming pool, squash court, golf putting green, gymnasium, health club and spa. There will also be a mini theatre for your entertainment within the vicinity. There will also be a grocery, bakery and a florist so you can enjoy all the conveniences nearby. To ensure good living, the homes will be designed to optimize natural light, ventilation views, safety and security. All windows will be double glazed thereby reducing noise and providing insulation. To avoid any sort of water supply issues and make the towers water efficient, there is rainwater harvesting, treatment and reuse. Smart fixture strategies will be deployed in all buildings. Although Mumbai mostly does not suffer from power issues, but the energy in this project has been designed to harness alternative sources of power. Solar panels will be installed for heating water, ensuring lower utility bills for every home. Isn't that amazing? Encouraging a greener lifestyle, charging points for electric vehicles will also be available in parking areas. What is the USP of this project? Well, for me, the USP is the fact that in a place like Mumbai, there would be so much greenery around. In fact, within the first week of its launch, almost 300 apartments got sold in the trees. So if you're looking for a township that not only has modern amenities, but is also surrounded by lush greenery in a place like Mumbai, then this is a project for you to consider. That was the first of the three projects that I handpicked for you. It's time now for a short break on Magic Bricks Now, India's first property business channel. But stay with me. When we get back, I will tell you about JP Dex at JP Infra in Goregaon, Eastern Mumbai. See you after this break. <laughs> 